our top local story. Tragedy strikes a family who are no strangers to loss. A widower and father of two dies trying to help someone else. David Babcock saw a boat run aground in the waters near his home and jumped in to offer a hand. Moments later, something went terribly wrong. Eyewitness News reporter Nika Nuosu is in New Bedford with more on this deadly rescue attempt from the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom. Well, friends and family members tell us that David Babcock was always willing to help someone, and he certainly proved that yesterday when he saved a man's life and made the ultimate sacrifice. Dave, you know, he's always had a big heart. Friends and family say David Babcock had to do something last night when he saw a man who appeared to be drowning in the water right behind his home on Padanarum Avenue in New Bedford. David ran into the water and was able to save the man. What happened next is still a mystery. Suddenly, David was spotted floating face down in the water. He was out, you know, trying to help somebody who was having, who was struggling with a sailboat in, in the in the cove, and we don't know exactly what happened yet. But uh, uh, you know, tragically, it, it uh, ended in him losing his life. The sailor's daughter ran out of the boat, calling for help, just as David was running into the water. Dave's neighbor says he heard the commotion and tried to help, but it was too late for his friend. I just came out, ran down, got in the water. Brought him out, we tried CPR, we had two people on him, but um, I think he was gone by then. Dave's family tells us the 59-year-old was a widower who was making a new life with his girlfriend. He was retired and volunteered with the Boy Scouts, New Bedford Schools, and enjoyed working on his home. But he was happiest being with the ones he loved. He's going to be missed by an awful lot of people. The family says they have not made funeral arrangements for David as of yet. He is survived by his two children, his girlfriend, and his four siblings. With the Mobile Newsroom, I'm Neka Nwosu, Eyewitness News.